All right, guys, we are continuing on the Spirit Halloween Tours. We are in Shererville, Indiana. I think that's how you say it. And there is a Spirit Halloween right behind me. And if you look close, you can see right through the front door, Mr. Grimm is waiting for us. I don't know what this used to be. You can sort of see a label scar up there behind the Spirit Halloween. But you can see over here where it says women and Mrs. Okay, let's go ahead in and see what kind of awesomeness they have in Shererville, Indiana. Hello, Mr. Grimm. Look, he's got his hand out. He's super loud. That is awesome. I was going to say, he's got his hand out like he's waiting for a high five. Oh, guys. I see some things over there that you're gonna like, cause I like them, so you're gonna like them. But we're gonna take the first few seconds here to see if they have our favorite shirt, and of course they don't. I cannot believe this shirt is sold out everywhere. This is probably my second favorite of the Ghost Face shirts up here. I do like this one, but that's my absolute favorite. Just can't find it anywhere. Looks like they probably sold out of the bog zombie, cause it looks like they did have him set up. But they have all four of the bubbles of death tubes inside here. That looks pretty cool. I like that they did that. Remember me saying I thought that they should put something in the middle there when they have this different setup? I was thinking more along the lines of an animatronic poking out, but that looks cool. All right, we're still on the lookout for Mr. Punchy. He's not here either. Neither is Shorty. Nope, he's not here either. However, over here, there is some awesomeness. And look at this, guys. They have a possessed pumpkin in stock right here, right now. Except for the flagship store, this is the first place I have seen the possessed pumpkin for sale and not even set up. Oh boy, am I tempted to buy this guy. Where in the heck would I put it? Man, if I had the Hummer, I could just put it in the back. But I have the tour bus, and I don't know if it would fit underneath in one of the compartments or what? If I go rolling out there with this giant thing and I have to put it on the bed, Marion is not going to be very happy. <laughs> All right, let's keep looking for a minute. Look at this, they have Monty. I cannot believe how much smaller Monty's box is than the Possessed Pumpkin. I mean, the Possessed Pumpkin is enormous, but so is Monty. All right, let's look on the other side here. I actually thought this was a Grim, but it's a Barry. Okay, and then we have three Lord Ravens here. I'm kind of surprised how many of these we're actually seeing in the stores, because I thought he would be hard to find, but they're getting more shipments now. Oh my gosh, guys, I can't stand it. I'm seeing so much awesome stuff in here. Look at this. The first store I've been in that actually had young Crouchy for sale. They have three of them and a little Skelly Bones and a Grim. And on the other side here, they have three Bag of Bones. I'm so excited I can't stand it. Now what, what in the world do I do? Do I get the Possessed Pumpkin or do I get Young Crouchy? Young Crouchy's only 170. Possessed Pumpkin is like 329. But he's huge. All right, let's look at some more stuff here before I get too excited and before I had to make my decision. Look at this. We've seen the Star Wars masks, but look at this, guys. I think we saw Superman in one of the other stores recently. But they have Batman in this store. And even better, they have the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. This is Michelangelo. I wonder if they put out all four of them. Man, if I knew for a fact that they had all four turtles among the stores, I would buy them. I would buy them all to display in my office. I'm way too excited in here. Okay, so anyways, we have four fogging skull piles, a whole stack of jumping spiders here and here. They have an awesome selection of the fleece throws, including the Nightcrawler and Crouchy. Oh, this one is sweet too. I love Scooby-Doo. I used to watch all the Scooby-Doo cartoons. And you gotta love Pennywise. And you gotta love Trick or Treat. And you gotta love Michael Myers. Oh my gosh, I am sweating like a hog up in this piece. Oh my gosh, I'm always sweating like a hog up in these pieces. Look at this, we have some more animatronics over here. It's the sitting scarecrow. They have one, two, three, four of them. And I love that more stores are getting these little animatronic, or not animatronic, but the little talking dolls. They got the pumpkin nester, the decrepit haunted doll, 
the Rosalie doll, the Hugs doll, and the Creepy doll that reminds me of the Creepy Rising doll animatronic. And they've got two burrito babies. Get down here and get them. I would adopt you. I would adopt you. I would adopt you. I would adopt you. I would definitely adopt you. And I would adopt you. Uh, never mind. You can stay. Look at this. I got three of these talking Chucky dolls. These guys are awesome. Are they going to work for us? Yeah, but you can't hear him because the music. If I was stuck in a cube, I would be mad too. Use your knife to get out. You can cut that plastic. Look, they have the vintage door knockers too. Let's do both of them at the same time. There we go. The chaos. I love it. We've got a Sam Groundbreaker here, a couple of Sam Greeters, Sam Inflatables, Sam on a Pumpkin, and we have Pennywise Side Steppers. Are they gonna work? Here we go. Pennywise is the one who stops sidestepping all the time. I've seen him in a couple stores where he makes the sound, but he doesn't actually sidestep. Here's another one down here, let's try him. Yeah, there he goes. All right, buddy. Back to the sewer for you. We haven't looked at these hanging props very much in the stores. Let's start with these guys. The vintage Frankenstein and the vintage devil. I'm not usually a devil guy, but let's just see if he works. There, his eyes light up. I like the way he looks because he looks vintage. He looks like those 70s masks from Halloween. But this guy, oh, you have a string on your eye. What the heck? Maybe we should call you String Eye Guy. Aw, oh, crap. His eyes light up, too, but they're not working right here. What is this one? What in the heck? Try me. Okay, come on. Please work. I want to see you work. Crap. 74-inch hanging ghost. That thing looks pretty creepy. I don't know if I've seen that in here before. Look, this one has a ponytail and button eyes. Then we have the kicking clown. There he goes. He's a leg kicker. There he goes, and his eyes are flashing, too. And we have the screaming nurse. I, I don't know what she said. When I'm free, I'll make you all suffer from something. And we have the stakeable scarecrow. Is he working? No, I think his eyes just light up. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. It's pretty creepy looking though. Inflatables over here. It looks like they pretty much have the same stuff as all the other stores have. I've been waiting to go into a store and see one that I haven't seen before. And there was that one that I had never seen before. It was in the flagship store, but I still don't remember what the heck it was. I'm gonna have to go back and watch that video again. And of course, here's the empty soul girl in a swing. There's seven of them. Somebody needs to adopt this girl. Sinister spirit dolls. I think she's my favorite of all the sinister spirit dolls because her eyes and her face are so creepy. Of course, they have lots of Chucky stuff, including this new ax, which I absolutely love. And I like this ruler too. Here we got both Pennywise masks side by side. Look at the hair on this Pennywise. Somebody crimped his hair, what the heck? Unfortunately, they are also waiting for the new Scream stuff. What a bummer. I can't wait to walk in and see all the new awesome masks that they have. I know they're gonna have a silver one. I know they're gonna have a blue one. And I know that they also just came out with a rainbow and a pumpkin one, but I don't know if these guys will have those. And let's take a quick peek over here. Oh, here's the Batman mask that I've been looking for. That one is one of the best Batman masks that I've seen. Pretty dang cool. All right, we got Michael Myers over here and Freddy and Jason. There's space for more over here, so maybe that answers this, but it kind of surprises me that they only have these three masks right now. I really thought that they would have Halloween Kills, and I don't know when the Halloween Ends mask comes out. Oh, here's the third kind of Freddy glove that we always see in the store. This is the one that's like the basic Freddy glove. I don't know even how much this thing is, but this is like the, oh, it's $12.99. So that's like the cheap version. It's just a plastic kind of bendable blades. And then you've got this one that's better quality, a little bit more money. I don't know how much. Let's see. $19.99 for that one. That's really not too bad. And then, of course, you have this deluxe one, which actually has 
metal blades on it so you'd really have to be careful with that one just use it like for display purposes and that one's $59.99 not too shabby if you're just going to stick it on the shelf I don't see anything else in here at the moment that I haven't seen in other stores of course they have tons of costumes but we'll have to do those another day when we find a store that doesn't have music very loud because I really want to be able to take the time to look at them instead of doing these quick edits to keep the music out Otherwise, I could start getting copyright strikes and my videos would start getting taken down, and we don't want that. Okay, I've made my decision on which animatronic I'm going to buy. You guys are just going to have to stay tuned and find out a little bit later. We're going to give a sticker to each of the burrito babies. There you go. And let's put some in this guy's hand. Maybe a couple for you. A couple for the sitting scarecrow. The jumping spiders. Mr. Grimm, Young Crouchy, Bagga 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 Bones, Lil Skelly Bones, and let's leave some for Freddy. Holy crap, guys, I was just getting ready to go and I was shown these two awesomenesses. Look at this. This is Skelly Bones. That is so awesome. And look at this one. It's Crouchy. <laughs> <laughs> look at his hair. Wait, okay, look at this. Reminds me of those trolls that you put on the top of a pencil and then you shake their head and their hair gets all fluffy like that. <laughs> <laughs>